Marcus syndrome people's chests are in or out. So how come Marfan syndrome people's chests are in and out? So, so the fancy name for that is called pectus. Okay, so you can remember that. I'm going to test you later. Pectus, okay? So it's pectus escovatum if it goes in, pectus carinatum if it goes out. All right? And so why does that happen? Well, nobody knows for sure, but one thought, and probably the explanation is that your ribs, okay, are bones as well, right? So you can imagine, put your fingers like this, all right? And if you squeeze them together, okay, what's going to happen? Okay, because the ribs, as they grow, the ribs have to go somewhere, right? So they, their fingers are going to collapse inwards, or they're going to squirt outwards, right? Well, otherwise, if they don't, they're going to crush against each other. And that's what's happening, probably, in Marfan syndrome, is that the ribs grow a little bit longer than they should. And then, so that pushes the chest out or in. Does that make sense?